everybody. I'm Owen McCall and I'm here with Ed Mamba, another Arctic driver. And um, first up, Ed, I'd like to thank you for taking the time to do this. Thank you. Thank you. The first question I would like to ask you is, uh, how did you get into racing and begin uh, your career? Started going to Andy Hilbert's uh, driving school back in the early 2000s and then just, just snowballed from there. Um, I just asked him one time, I said, what's the chance of me doing an Arctic race? If I could do it, just say I'd done it, kind of knock it off the bucket list. And well, that was 49 races ago. It was only intended to be one race deal. Here we are starting 50th race. Yeah, basically, what I've heard, Andy Hillenberg has done a lot for our Yes, uh, he's brought a lot of drivers up through, helped out a lot of drivers, helped out a lot of teams. He was a better, so he really helped out. So, um, could you tell us a little bit about your That didn't go over real well. Uh, first race at Pocono. Uh, it was a joint venture between Andy Hiller and Andy Belmont. So they wound up back in the car in the wall. It's all time lap, and about to destroy the back end of the car. They wound up rebuilding it in the garage and made the race. So you still made the race? Made the race, finished 25th. That's still impressive. It was. The, well, the, uh, the, amount of, the amount of parts they threw with that car was amazing. He got back out of the track. That is. That, it sticks in your mind. It's memorable. Put it that way. Oh, there's always going to be those things that stick in your mind. Um, what driver service you made inspiration? Uh, growing up, I always liked watching tennis races. Just anything with wheels, Kenny would drive. If there was a, if there was a race with shopping carts, he'd be in on. And I, I remember I read that he won like three straight 500 points. I was like. That's still, that's still pretty good. Yeah. Uh, uh, to you personally, what is the competition level for this race seem to be? It's good. I mean, there's, there's a lot of young talent here that, you know, they've been racing since they were you know, five, six years old. Um, a lot of quality cars. Um, what's your strategy to get to the front? It's a long race to see how it plays out. I've lost seen, it before, and, and oh, yeah. it's, it's a son of a gun trying to get back. Yeah, uh, first hand at all my years to come to the track, I've seen what happens when you lose the draft.